Have you ever wanted to auto populate something from a CSV file inside Survey123 Connect? It's pretty easy. You just need to know how to do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to do it. All this information right down here is pulling from a CSV file. This is just a copy of the username because the username type is hidden by default. So what does that look like? Here's the username type. And this is a copy of the username because this one is hidden, but I wanted you to be able to see what my username is. And so you can see it here, Survey123Jedi. Why do you need to know that? Because we are going to use the username as a key inside the CSV file. And so you'll notice that contact.csv, all lowercase, is what I named it. You'll notice that the first column is contacts. Contacts is your CSV file. You'll notice that every single one of these match the headers over here in my CSV file. The next one is username key. You'll notice that that's in the CSV file, username key. And then we have this field here, which is very similar um, to what we're used to seeing when we need to pull a field. So you're looking over here for the username AGOL. The, so the username key and the username AGOL sync together and are able to pull information from your CSV file. I hope that all makes sense and that you can dominate your world. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.